Once again, you are in the kitchen with Chef Bar Allen, and today I'm doing a baked shrimp scampi. Guys, thanks as always for liking and subscribing, and definitely your support. Enough of talking, let's get down to it. The shrimp, you, you want to get the big shrimps, uh, whatever kind you like. I'm doing a black, a tiger black claw shrimps. You know, because I like them, they're, they're more bigger and fluffier, easier to make. There's certain things you want to cook with is different shrimps. Uh, the mixture is just the garlic, the crushed red pepper, salt and pepper, and uh, the lemon juice. And I, I use a sherry cooking wine, some of them say the white cooking wine. But those that don't want no alcohol, non-alcohol, you can always use chicken broth. I cook my pasta off ahead of time, because uh, it's Chef R. Allen, meals made easy for a reason. Okay, then you're gonna have your, uh, that'll be the top in the, we're gonna melt some butter and breadcrumb. Okay, so we'll start off, we're gonna start off putting the shrimps in here. Some people leave the tails on, some people don't. I'm, on this one, I'm not gonna leave the tails on. They like to leave the tails on and pick it up easy. To me, I'm gonna pick it up either way. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna get a nice oven. You want a nice oven baking dish? You want lay these down flatly. You don't want to overcrowd them. You don't want to stuff them. Double up on them. So while I got this in the pan, you know, I just want you guys, I, I like to make it easy. I just want you guys to, to make, let it make it real simple for you guys. So we're going to add, I'm going to add the lemon juice. Add some garlic. A little salt and pepper. The sherry is going to cook down, but it, that's, it just gives, to me, it gives a better flavor than just the cooking wine. And then a couple of crushed peppers, recipe be at the bottom of the description. Okay, so while, while I got that seed, I'm going to marinate, start melting this butter. It'll be at the bottom of the description. So we got this buttermilk and that buttermilk. Then I'll put my, my breadcrumb, my panko breadcrumb, mix all that together. Okay, for this, we are gonna stir all this together. It's real simple, guys. You're gonna pour that in there. It's only gonna take like 12, it's only gonna take like 12 to about 10 to 12 minutes to once to get the shrimp to cook in. I got that on medium. Well, that's gonna be your topping. You're gonna, you're gonna put the topping. So while that's cooking, while that's melting, I'm gonna add my breadcrumbs. Cut it off now because it's melted. Oh yeah. And you got the butter melting here. And that's gonna be your topping. Is, is put the breadcrumbs on top of here, put it in the oven, and it's going to be the best shrimp scampi you ever had.
You heard it from me. Okay, guys, it's about that time. Let's see what the shrimp scamp taste look like. Oh yeah, oh yeah. That's that's what I'm talking about right here, guys. That right there. You see the bubbly? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's that's what I'm talking about. The big shrimp scampi. Oh yeah. Guys, you see I said that, that didn't take long, simple to make, easy to make. I got the pasta already cooked off. And this is my baked shrimp scampi, guys. Simple and easy, but more importantly, delicious to eat. Until next time, guys, I'll be seeing you in the kitchen with Chef R.L.